Right, so this is a Audi Allroad C5 A6 and we are going to change the screen washer bottle because it is leaking. Right, first things first, pull the cap off. There we go. Pull it hard. <laughs> oh, it's to get your jack under. I don't need to tell you how to do that. You should know where jack and points are. <clears throat> Let's rattle these off. He says. So on these A6s and Q7s, I have to have jacking mode done because of the uh, air suspension. And that's done on the MMI uh, display inside the vehicle. So then start removing all the uh, star torque screws from around the uh, liner of the arch. So you got one 10 mm bolt, another 10 mm bolt, torques, screw, one there, one there, one up there, one there, one there, and just check, make sure there ain't any others, but as far as I can see, oh yeah, there's one up there as well, so I'll move that, don't want to move the whole lot though. So, there's quite a few around there, there's a bolt there to remove, one there, so 10 mil, 10 mil torques. There's quite a few torques all the way around. Um, so just be careful you get them all out just so you can get the uh, arch liner off. Just put it to the side like that and then you ain't got to take the whole thing off. And there's a washer bottle bolt there. And there's a bolt underneath and there's one at the front up here. That's the same as the and, uh, and there's one. You can see, Let me get the angle on it. But there's one there as well. There's one there. That's it. All right. So there's a plug here. And there's little tabs at the top and bottom. Just squeeze them. And you'll hear them click, and then that pulls off. All right. So removed. One bolt, ten mil. Two bolts, three bolts, and it should just pull out. He says. Here we go. Yeah, so when you're removing this uh, yeah, washer is, bottle, a um, there. try and be really be. careful when you put it down. So I didn't realize there was two pumps. I thought it was just one on the left there, but there's one behind. So try and detach it if you can. But, I mean, if you pull it down, it shouldn't really break, but it depends how old your car is. So the second hand washer bottle that we've got didn't have a port for the uh, rear washers. So we had to modify it. Here's the hole drilled for the rear screen washer. Um, basically, it was drilled out with a step drill and it just requires the grommet putting in now. So that was about, a sort, what was it, 20, 20 mil was it? 20 mil step 20 drill, mil. Yeah. I'll do it to 18 with a step drill and then try and then put 20 and put the grommet in. So we've changed this pump, literally these pipes pull off. Um, just be really careful pulling them off. They should come off with ease, but they could break, so be wary of that. She should just push in, push and click. This is Pushes in at a slight angle and then push down and then push in, push back. Just be careful and snap the tip of the pump. So that's in. And then you just need to get, it's a bit fiddly, you just need to get this pump in here and push, push in and down. And then she should just feel the fingers, you can tell if it's in or not. And then that's in. So the pump that's in front of the bottle, the connector's a bit tricky, but you've got to put your hand over, push it up, and it does go on. That's it. Right. Sure it yeah, you need, to, you need to check it works for a bolt up. So we did put one bolt in at the top just to stop the uh, washer screen bottle like dropping with the yeah. weight of the water. That's a good start. That's a good start. So we're working, 
Yes, boys, we're in action. And girls, the rear one, we've got to clean the jet out, but it is working. There we go. Rear, come on, work. Ready? Yeah. Might take a bit of time. Nothing. Oh, here we go, yeah, it's coming out now. I need to aim the nozzle up a bit. Perfect, there you go. Pick in the hole, adjust your jet, and uh, well, we use a bit of brake cleaner. We use a bit of the compressed air in the brake cleaner in the, uh, in the hole. Job zoggerin. Right, so you've got one 10 mil there, 10 mil up there, and just see it, 10 mil up there, and a 10 mil there. Get it done. And the deliveries continue as normal way. Oh, that one's gone. He's got another one. <laughs> yes. Oh. Oh, it's in. Oh. Voila. They're all back in. Don't ask me how many. I didn't count, but just make sure you take them all out. <laughs> Otherwise, you'll bust the liner. Right, and just... So yeah, get the wheel back on, take the jack off, do the nuts, and take for a test drive, and jobs are good in. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you on the next one.